Hi, we're in Larimer talking to Dan Yablonski. Dan. Hey. Hey, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Uh, tell me, you're an, you're a somewhat new resident to Larimer. I am. I moved here uh, at the beginning of 2012. Okay. Mm -hmm. And so you've been here for about a year, mm -hmm. and you work not so far away. Right. right? You work, work down, uh, our office just moved to uh, Lawrenceville. Okay. Yeah. And, and you work at Bike Pittsburgh. Bike Pittsburgh. Bike PGH. Yep. That's a nonprofit bike advocacy organization in the city. Oh, cool. Mm -hmm. So you must be passionate about biking. Absolutely. Yeah. And then how is Larimer for, for biking? Larimer is incredible. It's a flat, it's it's one of Pittsburgh's only flat oasis. Yeah. So I can, uh, I got to come up a huge hill from, from Lawrenceville and then uh, down a big hill through Friendship, but then I get to cruise all the way home <laughs> in the flats of Larimer. Yeah. And then you also like gardening, I guess. Or... I do. I like gardening. Uh, my house and I have two plots in these uh, two beds over here. We've got radishes started just two weeks ago, and uh, we've got some seeds sprouting at the house, so that'll mm -hmm. be up and coming in the next few days. Oh, cool. Are there, mm -hmm. a, are there a lot of, like, I guess, transplants or, like, new people like you or uh, in Larimer? Or? Yeah, well, so I live with a house of, of people who also moved into Larimer at the beginning of last year, and uh, I think there are a couple in the neighborhood, a couple mm -hmm. others, but, yeah, there's, there's a lot of young energy. Yeah. You came here because you can get, you can get a, a pretty big house. Yeah, so we came here because uh, my roommates and I were all part of the... Uh, SCA, Student Conservation Association's Green City Fellowship Program. And that's a program that brings in uh, recent graduates mm -hmm. and pairs them with nonprofits in the city and uh, kind of helps them out as they go through this uh, professional development training year. Yeah. So we had five new, uh, new fellows at all different organizations and we were all wanting to live, to live together. So the only five bedroom we could find was over on Winslow Street, and it's a gorgeous house by an awesome landlord, and we've had, been having a lot of fun there. Oh, cool. Yeah. Tell me more about the community in Larimer, how, how, you've, how your interactions have been with them. Yeah, I mean, my interactions have, uh, have been overwhelmingly positive. Uh, I was in a bike crash uh, in May of 2012 that put me in the hospital for four months. I couldn't walk for six months, and that was an incredibly difficult time for me, uh, as I'm sure you can imagine. But uh, all the residents here, uh, even while I was in the hospital, I still felt like I had supporters uh, from Larimer and everybody was rooting for me. So. Oh, wow. That's something that you don't often find, I guess, nowadays in, in communities. And it's really great to hear that. Yeah, there's definitely a, a, sense, of, a sense of community that e even to someone like me who's new, uh -huh. I had only lived in the neighborhood for uh, three months bef before I got hit. Yeah. And... Uh, even being here for that little time, everyone was very supportive. So, what are the other things about Larimer that you that you like? That I like, I like the Kingsley Center, and that, for me as a new resident, was a great way to get involved and meet people. Mm -hmm. And you can get involved with programs like the Green Team doing the uh, the garden or all these different greening projects around the neighborhood. There's Red Up and they clean lots. Uh, they celebrate and they hold a festival every year. Um, and then. Uh, communicate or somebody but there's there's a, a group that keeps all the residents involved right and there's a lot of and, and people are pretty active at the Kingsley Center doing yep. the activities people are very active cool mm -hmm. and, are, and then um, and then also the gateway I guess the gateway oh yeah community. the gateway I love the way uh, I think just coming down Larimer Ave uh, once you cross East Liberty you get you get a, a sense that you're in a, a, a you get a sense of place yeah. between the uh, the new eco center that's on your right, between the mural that's on the side of the building over there, uh, between these churches and this garden that now has a play space and a concert venue over there. Uh, just give it, I get very excited when I come down the street. Yeah, I think, I think everybody does. I mean, it's a welcoming um, place where there's friendly people and it's beautiful and you have a lot of things here. Yeah. So um, Larimer, it's a good place to live and it's a good place to be. It's great. Um, thanks a lot for being on the show, Dan. Oh, thank you, man. And uh, yeah, it's been very interesting talking to you. Yeah, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thanks for listening to me. Yeah.